Hello gamers, hope you all doing well. It's been a while since I cover some enlisted content. So today, we are gonna check out the latest patch that just dropped for enlisted, with a lot more exciting content, plus some huge FPS improvements for low-end gamers. Before moving on, we just hit 22,000 subs, and thank you everyone who supports. If you like this content and still haven't subscribed, please make sure to hit that subscribe button and join the notification squad as well. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. Okay guys, if you don't know about Enlisted. Enlisted is a free-to-play, squad-based, World War II, first-person shooter which I cover in my channel well ago. To be honest guys, I haven't had the chance to play the game recently. But a huge update has just dropped a few days ago, so I think it's a good time to revisit. The biggest change with the new update is the new campaign, The Battle of Tunisia. It's currently available in close beta. If you want to join the close beta test, you to buy the Battle of Tunisia bundle. But fortunately I had the chance to play, and I'll share my experience with you guys. The battles in Tunisia will take place in a large African city, and in a more desert area. And I have to say guys, the new maps are looks stunning. There are two new maps called the Gorge and Alhar. One is representing a beautiful African city filled with markets and roads. And the other one is representing a large open area with huge bridge connecting two sides. The both maps are well made with some historical accuracy, and also they are aesthetically pleasing. Let's look at some gameplay. And another new feature that they add was a shovel. You can use it to dig trenches to make some cover, or you can use it as a melee weapon, which is pretty cool feature in my opinion. They also add tons of new weapons to both factions. 
including Thompson M1921, Beretta M38 and Carcano M38. And there is tons of balances, minor changes and bug fixes, which I'm not going to discuss. If you guys interested, I'll leave the link in the description. But the most excited new thing they add to the game, is AMD's Fidelity FX Super Resolution, which also known as the FSR. It's a cutting-edge upscaling technology from AMD, to help boost your frame rates massively. Most importantly, FSR will works pretty much in all graphics cards, including video cards. It render your game in a lower resolution and upscale it to your native resolution, which gives you huge FPS boost. I've tested this on my GTX 960, the results are pretty amazing. I will do a separate video, regarding the test results and performance. So, stay tuned for that as well guys. Well, that's pretty much it. I will leave you with some gameplay of the new campaign. I see you guys soon in my next video, stay safe.